Welcome back. A Sioux Falls restaurant has a new menu for you to try. Crave American Kitchen and Sushi Bar will soon be opening its doors in Sioux Falls. Nick and Alex join us today and tell us what people can expect from Crave. Well, we're a uh, fresh, vibrant concept um, out of Minneapolis. We have a Japanese kitchen and we have an American kitchen. So we do a lot of different sushi and things from that end. We also have traditional pastas, pizzas, burgers, and sandwiches in the American kitchen as well. And you guys are opening in the old element space in the Hilton Garden in yeah. downtown yes. in about a week, right? Yep. About uh, May 13th as we're looking. Okay. Um, we'll let people know as soon as the doors are open. Um, we're located at 201 East 8th Street in the Hilton Garden Inn, the hotel itself. Okay, so Chef Alex, you're going to... Try so show us some of Teach us. what you're doing. We're gonna be doing the uh, shrimp fried rice bowl. So okay, and what's you know unique about some of uh, some of your seafood? Do you is is it fresh or what's different? Everything's gonna be more scratch cooking in this. A lot of restaurants have kind of gone away from that. So we're gonna be hitting that. So it's gonna be more fresh, more vibrant. Everything that crave is pretty. Much. So I went up there for two months, trained, and I wow. was, I'm sold on it. So. It's going to be good. Everything on sushi, all the way from salads, pastas, steaks, everything, total package. And, I mean, yeah, it's two very different concepts, from the sushi to mm -hmm. the steak. So what has been the newest part for you? The sushi, by far. So okay. I'm not trained in that before I went out there, but then I learned, and it's like a fish out of water, so I feel like. So. <laughs> Literally. So yeah. we've got a couple of things across the front here. Yeah, absolutely. First up on the sushi, uh, the Hoshi boat we have up here. The first roll we have up here is our Mexican roll, and then our second roll is the bamboo bite, and then we got different garnishes on there too. Then we have our chopped chicken salad right here, and then we have our baked penne from our saute station, and then we have our Argentine ribeye right there as well. So, with multicolored cauliflower. Yes. Right? Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> we always joke about it, but we always say that there needs to be smell of vision because it Seriously. just doesn't bring you the same effect at home as it does <laughs> right now because it smells fantastic. And then another big thing that we're doing out there is they're building a 30-seat uh, bar on the patio right on the river. So we'll actually have outdoor seating with the bar out there as well. And we're working on doing quite a few different things to bring some nightlife stuff to downtown Sioux Falls. Yeah, that'll be pretty different for downtown. Mm -hmm. What are you adding here to the shrimp? Right here is just uh, called gochujang sauce. It's kind of like an Asian Korean barbecue type sauce. So it's just a nice little coating around it, caramelize around it also. Okay, so we're going to finish cooking some of this and try <laughs> it when we come back. The KDLT kitchen.